Hello everyone and welcome back to the Motopress YouTube channel. My name is Valerie and today we have exciting news for all appointment booking users. We are delighted to introduce the checkout field add-on. With the new extension, you can completely transform the customer checkout experience. You can collect more information about customers via the booking form by incorporating new field types. We've added 10 field types to build your ideal checkout. On the other hand, with the add-on, you can make any field non-required or completely disable unnecessary ones. Sounds perfect, doesn't it? Get comfy, stay tuned, and I'll show you all the key features that make the checkout fields add-on stand out. Before we dive into today's content, Remember to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell icon to stay updated with our latest videos. Subscribing to our channel ensures you're part of our growing community and the first to know about our newest releases and exclusive content. And also be sure to check out the description box below for quick access to different parts of this video. Just scroll down and you'll find all the timestamps there. It's a handy way to navigate through the content and find exactly what you're interested in. Now, let's get started. Before we start, let's talk about a common frustration businesses face. The checkout process. Many businesses struggle to collect all the necessary information from their customers during the booking process, leading to confusion and inefficiencies. But fear not. The solution to this problem lies in the checkout fields add-on. Whether you need to collect additional contact information, preferences, or special requests, the add-on has you covered. With the Checkout Fields add-on, it's easy to customize the appointment booking form to suit your specific service offerings, and you can add fields relevant to your business, such as any special client requests or notes or any other information necessary for appointment scheduling or follow-up communication. For example, it's possible to add fields for clients to provide any relevant medical or health information. If you're operating a yoga studio and need to find out about the student level and goals, or if you want to capture a preferred language for the city tour booking, the add-on is what you need. For this video, I will use our free barbershop theme that comes with the light version of the appointment booking plugin. I upgraded my plugin to Pro, but it's not compulsory. Our add-on is compatible with both the light and Pro versions. And whether you're using light or Pro, you can seamlessly integrate our add-on into your system. The main requirement is that your appointment booking plugin must be updated to version 1.23 or greater. And now let me show you just how easy it is to use the checkout fields add-on. Once you've installed and activated the plugin, go to Appointments, Checkout fields. You'll see the list of four default fields you can edit. So it means at the checkout step, the default booking form allows you to collect basic customer details such as a name, email address, phone number, and customer notes. Without the checkout fields extension, those fields are fixed and you cannot move them, rename, or delete them. But with the new extension, it became possible. To edit the default field, hover your mouse over the chosen one and click Edit. You can modify all parameters of the default fields except for the system name and field type. It's worth mentioning the add-on allows you to make any field non-required, completely disabling even default fields in the booking form. This way, the customer can be redirected to the payment 
or confirmation page right after choosing a time in the availability calendar. But please note, you cannot disable the email field if you allow customer account registration on your website. Email addresses are used as unique identifiers for user accounts. Disabling the email field would mean users cannot provide a unique identifier for their account, which could lead to confusion or conflicts in the system. And if we're talking specifically about this field type, we can add a short hint that describes what kind of information should be entered there, or you can add a description or additional CSS classes if needed. If you want to add new fields, click the Add New button. Then you should select the type, and depending on the type, you'll come across different parameters you'll need to set. Using the example of the text field type, I'll show you common parameters. The common parameters for all types will be a title. This field uh, name users will see on the front end. And one more common parameter is a unique system name. Uh, one more common perimeter I've already mentioned is the description, uh, which will be displayed under the field. I'm not going to add a description here, but later I'll show you how it works with other fields. Okay. Uh, developers can make fields look different by adding custom classes to them. This can significantly improve visual contrast in checkout experiences or emphasize specific fields for user attention. And to customize the field, you can add uh, one or multiple CSS classes. Fields offer the flexibility to be designated as either required or non-required. Required fields are compulsory for submission, ensuring essential information is provided. And you can enable or disable fields. Enabled fields are displayed in the form and disabled are hidden. Everything is clear here. In general, a text field type can be adopted in many ways. For example, you can ask customers how they found out about your business. And this can provide valuable insights into your marketing efforts and allow you to refine your marketing strategy accordingly. Next, I'm going to add a checkbox field type. Checkbox fields can be used for various purposes, such as indicating preferences. So I'm typing in the appropriate text. You can choose to display such fields checked by default. And to create a new option, uh, you should create a new checkbox field. Now let's change the order of the fields by dragging and dropping. It's super easy. And now it's high time to check out uh, what it all looks like in the booking wizard. Looks great. Perfect. Now it's a country field types turn, offering a drop-down list of countries. Makes it easy for users to select their country from a comprehensive list. And this is a simple country selector, a drop-down menu with a list of countries. It might be useful for appointments involving virtual services. You can implement a date of birth field type too, a handy three field selector for choosing a birthday. Knowing a user's birthday can enable personalized experiences such as sending birthday wishes and offering special promotions or discounts. A standard email field might come in handy if you need to ask for the secondary email 
or when someone might be booking an appointment for another person. A basic heading field can serve as a section divider for your checkout form, so it breaks your checkout into individual semantic sections. And these headings provide clear labels, making it easier for users to navigate and understand the information they need to provide. They act as visual cues, signaling a change in the form content or purpose. The paragraph field type can be used to display important notices or instructions to customers during the booking process. This could include information about appointment policies, terms and conditions, cancellation policies, or any other relevant details that customers need to be aware of before finalizing their booking. By providing this explanatory text clearly and prominently, businesses can ensure that customers are well informed and understand what is expected of them, ultimately leading to a smoother and more transparent booking experience. Incorporating a phone field type, you can ask a customer to provide a secondary phone number. This can be particularly useful in emergencies or urgent situations. So, for this field type, I want to add an explanatory description and a pattern. If the primary phone number is unavailable, having a secondary number ensures better communication and accessibility in various scenarios. Important calls won't be missed. With the help of the select field type, you can give customers a few options to choose from. Let's say you can offer additional services or treatments that customers can choose to add to their appointments. All options are created within one field. Just enter a value and a label for each option. Last but not least, a text area field type allows customers to add a longer answer, for instance, provide feedback or comments on their past experiences. The title might not be necessary for this field. Instead of the title, I add a placeholder. It can act as a visual cue for users, reminding them of the type of information they should enter without the need for extra labels. Also, you can add a description. And now I'm going to finish the booking process and then get back to the dashboard. The data collected through the fields is saved in the bookings menu. To see this data, you need to open the needed booking and after opening, you'll see the checkout fields section. On top of that, it's possible to edit this data. One more great thing is that you can use the information collected through your custom checkout fields in any email template. To include custom checkout field data in your automated customer emails, go to Settings. And under the Email tab, select the specific customer email template you want to modify. And the available tags are listed below the template. These tags correspond to the custom checkout fields you've enabled in your form via the checkout fields menu. Simply copy the relevant tags and paste them into your email content uh, where you want uh, your customers to see it. We've already discussed benefits for businesses, but what does this mean for your customers? Well, it means a smoother booking process from start to finish. By providing additional fields for preferences, you're offering them a more personalized experience. 
Customers will provide all the necessary information up front, reducing the need for back and forth communication and potential misunderstandings. The service provider, in its turn, has all the necessary information to deliver a satisfactory experience. Alternatively, you can enable quick bookings and payments. You can make any field non-required or completely delete chosen ones and make it super simple for customers without a need to fill in any field. Overall, the checkout fields add-on enhances the booking experience for customers by providing them with more control, clarity, and convenience throughout the process. To wrap things up, the checkout fields add-on empowers business owners to create a more tailored and efficient checkout experience for the customers, leading to increased satisfaction and loyalty with just a few clicks, you can customize your booking form to match your business needs. So, ready to take your booking process to the next level? Visit the link in the description below to learn more and get started with the checkout fields add-on today. That's all for now. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.